Hi guys, this is Abbas Mirza from TechAce. This video is a part 2 video. This video demonstrates how you can upgrade Eureka Plus from Lollipop to Nougat version 7.1. If you want to upgrade from KitKat to Lollipop, then you can click on the part 1 video given link below. So here we start video part 2. Come on, let's see. So guys, for upgrading Eureka Plus from Lollipop 5.1.1 to 7.1.1 we need almost two files one file is this ROM file RRN580 this is a restoration ROM and not a cyanogen mode ROM and another file is Google Apps these two files need to be downloaded from internet I have given the link in the below video you can download from there and copy it into your USB pen drive so I have as I have already put these files into my pen drive now quickly I will plug into the pen drive into my mobile device and start flashing this ROM so guys for this you have to insert pen drive into the USB port over here and after inserting you need to press some of the switches in order to activate it, the recovery mode you need to press up key down key and power key all at a once so this is been inserted and I press the up key down key and power key all at once once i get a display i will release the all the keys so that this will go into a recovery mode so see this now you have got a display on the mobile and soon this will go into recovery mode see this team win and we are into a recovery screen right now this swipe to allow modifications once you got this window go to wipe and go to wipe advance and choose all the things like Dalvit cache system data and internal storage cache don't select micro SD card and don't select a USB OTG if it all shows there and also don't select internal storage if you have placed your file into your mobile device internal storage then please don't select internal storage as I have placed this into a pen drive and so I have selected this internal storage now just simply swipe to wipe swipe to wipe see this, this is wiping now all the information is wiping off Dalvis cache system and all that Meanwhile, I just pause the video. So, guys, all the data has been wiped off as you can see. This has been wiped off. Now, go to back again. Go to back from this key, this back key, back again, back, and now go to install and go to up one level up. And choose your OTG pen drive or internal storage where you have kept the files. I have kept this file into the internal into the OTG. See this OTG. I select I select OTG and under that I had put the files in Eureka Plus. I go to Eureka Plus to flash for Nougat 7.1.1 OS. Select and just simply swipe. To confirm the flash swipe to confirm the flash see this this is now flashing the ROM into the Eureka plus this will take some time to flash there are almost three to four minutes or maximum five minutes this will take to flash entire ROM meanwhile I will just pause the video see guys as you can see this ROM has been flashed it took almost two minutes to flash the entire ROM and now it asking for reboot 
and swipe Dalvis cache. After flashing the ROM, I will press this wipe Dalvis cache again and say swipe to wipe. And after this wipe, I will install the Google Apps also right away. Just pause the video. <coughs> so, guys, the wiping has been done successfully. I know it's asking for reboot system. Before rebooting system, I will go to flash Google Apps right away. Back, I go to back, open GApps ARM 64 7.1 nano zip file. I select this file and I swipe to confirm the flash. So, guys, this has started now. The ROM which has flashed doesn't have a Go Labs into it. So this is what is the Go Labs is going getting installed. I had given the links of Go Labs and resolution ROM into this video at the bottom of this video. You can go through it. Meanwhile, I just pause the video as this will take much time to load. So guys, this has been completed. Installation done. So this installation completed. Done. Now just simply reboot to system. Now you can see this is booting. And this will take a bit time up to up to four to five minutes first boot will take time and this may go up to 10 minutes also it depends upon how much it takes time it's a beautiful animation of resolution os so guys this has been started as you can see the welcome screen India English and I just click on get started setup is new don't use any network for setup just click this and say ok continue continue and swipe up and say next asking me who is the owner of the phone just you can put any name it's asking me to choose a launcher which launcher I want to use I prefer pixel launcher so I just say pixel launcher it's a good pixel launcher I like the pixel launcher I love it pixel launcher always so finally the device is up and running it is having it is having a resolution rom 7.1.1 see there is no icon over here there is no icon over here. you have to place some icons over here I just slide up and just you can keep press the phone button here and again you can go to slide up in this way you can put sms button also sms or whatever you want swipe up to get the app drawer swipe down back to home screen see this all very nicely made i love this and i go to settings to see how much space I have got in the storage compartment of it storage see this showing over here no need to go to a uh, story in detail it's showing over here it's a good thing of Android 7 2.9 GB is used out of 14.646 GB 2.9 GB is used out of 14.668 GB I go to storage this in this way you get 
almost 12 uh, uh, 14.68 2.91 14.68 14.68 minus 2.91 11 so almost you get 11.7 GB free space out of 15 GB okay in about you can see this is Android 7.1.1 OS and RAM is almost you get 1.893 MB that is almost 2.2 GB of RAM the ROM is resolution resolution version 5.8 official VOLT this ROM supports VOLT guys only one thing remains now and that is flashing a VOLT modem file which I will demonstrate in another video. That's all with this video. Thank you. I will provide a VOLT modem file video link in this comment box of this video. Thank you. That's all with this video. Hope you like my video. Hope you like uh, this ROM also. Do comment in the comment section. If you have any question, you can ask any question regarding this. I will try to uh, answer the question. Guys. I request you all to please subscribe to my channel. If you have not subscribed yet, then please subscribe to my channel.